Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about Credo Shet syndrome. Credo Shet syndrome is a chromosome deletion syndrome. A part of the chromosome is deleted. Credo Shet means cry of the cat in French, and it was first described by a French genetist. So the cry becomes less obvious as the child grows. So cry is more obvious during the infancy. As the child becomes a toddler, the cry of a cat is less obvious. So diagnosis may be a little difficult after infancy. Cry to shed syndrome is caused by deletion of the distal part of the short arm of chromosome 5. This is the deletion of the short, this is a short arm, this is a long arm. Short arm, a part of the short arm has been deleted here. Okay. The karyotype, that is the chromosomal constitution of an individual, is 5. P minus, P means short arm, Q means long arm. So this 5P minus frequency is 1 in 50,000 live birth. So Credo Shed syndrome has characteristic facial appearance. They have small mandible, micronet here. There may be cleft palate or hair lip in some cases. There may be epicanthal fold. But more obvious is hypertellurism. The orbit are more separated. There may be low set ear. Head may be small. Okay. There may be heart disease like ASD, BSD, patent ductus arteriosus. Short neck. There may be hemi vertebra so a patient with cardio shed syndrome may have multiple features not necessarily all features will be present in one child of cardio or of credo shed syndrome okay if you go to the next slide so here they are mentally retarded intellectual disability they have with an average IQ of 35. Microcephaly, head is small in most cases. Distincting facial appearance like epicanthal fold, micronethia, small mandible, short neck, clap palate, there may be hair lip, there may be hair lip, hypertellurism, two orbits are separated more than usual. Okay, laryngomalacia, larynx does not develop properly. Strider, there may be sound during expiration, obstructive sound because of maldevelopment of the larynx, and there may be obstruction in the trachea. Trachea may have maldevelopment, so there will be sound during respiration. Hemivertebra, one side of the vertebra may not develop, that may lead to scoliosis. There may be congenital heart defect like ventricular septal defect, atrial septal defect, or patent ductus arteriosus. Anyone is possible or multiple defect may be present or may not be any heart defect in some of the Credo-Shed syndrome patient. Mortality rate is high, although most of the patient reaches adulthood. Mortality rate depends on this BSD or ASD or patent ductus arteriosus. And that's all about Credo Shed syndrome. If you have any question, please feel free to ask me. Please share the information with your friends. Please support my channel. Please subscribe me. Have a nice, wonderful and blessed day. Bye now.